here we are again, another CX and charity, charity shop hunt. We are in Bromsgrove, and there's a Weatherspoons right here. Karen ain't gonna be able to get out of the car, it's too big. <laughs> but yeah, we've uh, we've just been to a location now, we're at the next one, so we're gonna stop for lunch first because uh, it's lunchtime and we're hungry. So yeah, straight to the Weatherspoons in Bromsgrove. And here we are, the Golden Cross apparently. All right, let's go and get some food. So here we are in the Golden Cross. Karen's got herself. How mushroom pizza? How mushroom pizza? She's very happy with that. What's this you're drinking at midday? Uh, double absolute vodka and diet Pepsi. A double vodka. <laughs> and I've got a nice chicken wrap with a side salad and just a normal Pepsi. Pepsi Max. All right, let's enjoy this food. Mm. No charity shops down this end of town, but we've got this lovely little park here. Look at this nice building. All right, we're going to go back up that end there. Hopefully, that's where all the charity shops are and CX and everything else. First up, we've got a Salvation Army. Got to get across the road. All right. Mm. Sadly, no video games. But we'll have a little look around, see what else is in here. Why is it every day we do these hunts? It's market day. It's got a quite nice little wife street, this. No uh, cars come allowed down it. But yeah, because it just popped in WH Smith, I'm going to go meet up with her. Yes, he is. Looking at some magazines. <laughs> Alright, right, first up, we've got a British Heart Foundation. Let's go and check out what's in here. Here she goes again, American candy shop, straight in there, looking at all the sweets. <laughs> so here we are, CEX, what they got in the window, not much. It's the second copy I've seen kind of darkness today. Oh, that PlayStation 3 controller looks all right. Kingsfield there, 130 quid. All right. Go in and have a look what they've got inside. flowers here but next up we've got acorns local children hospice go check it out oh, we've got loads over here look at this nothing worth getting though right next up age uk oh very fancy window in this one let's go see what they got mm. no nope, no games all right, another fancy looking window. We've got Bernardo's. Let's go see if they've got any uh, good stuff. We've got some big Winnie the Pooh there. Yeah, some Marvel characters. Right, let's go in and check it out. We've got a few in here. Destiny. A few Fifas. Dancing games. Yeah, a couple of PC. Nothing much. Next up, cancer research issues after a bargain. So we can find one. Sadly, all I've found is this one PC game, Orange Gym. Oh, well, we've made it to the end of the town, but we've still got two more charity shops. So we've got a blue cross there, but first up, we're going to go into Primrose Hospice. Hopefully, they've got some stuff in there. Let's have a look. Mm, sadly, 
nothing. Oh well, it was worth a look. All right, last up for Brimsgrove, Brimsgrove, whatever it's called. We've got the Blue Cross. Let's go check that one out. Eleven to thirteen. PS3. Oh look, an Xbox 360 game. Oh, I know. Straight. Alright. Nothing else. Got some books though. Two pound. You're in. Go on, Tommy. Come by. Well, that is everything in Bromsgrove. Pretty nice tan. Very clean, tidy. Loads of charity shops. All right. I did pick up one game from CX. Nice steel book. So I get back to the hotel. I will show you that. But yeah, quite like it here, very nice and clean. Oh, I just need to go to the post office, post some letters. Let's go in there, the old post office. Oh, it's a pub. Oh, well, can't post nothing. Wow, look at this Tudor house. Quite nice, that. And here we are, the second week in a row, back in Karen's favourite hotel. <laughs> Sorry, it's not even listening. Love this hotel, yeah? No. Why not? It's great. Forty pound a night. Cheap, <laughs> cheap shit, wanky. Okay. No, it's good. It's great. We've got this lovely wall of flowers, <laughs> leaves. I don't know what we want to call it. Anyway, that's not what you come here. Did you come to see what I picked up from uh, Bromgrove? Is it Bromgrove? No. What? Bromsgrove. Bromsgrove. Get it right. I will get these right one day. Right. So I picked up a steel book from CEX there. Absolutely lovely place, as you can see, Weatherspoons was back. Having it's like a bit more healthy. Kaz loves a good Weatherspoons. <laughs> right, so I picked up one game. I believe I've already got it in the collection, but this is a lovely steel book. It was probably meant to have a slip cover or something on it, but for the artwork, I couldn't turn it down. And that is Borderlands 3. Look at that. So it's got... Lovely art style there, look at all them roses everywhere. Don't know if it was meant to come with anything on the inside, but all it's got is the disc. So, for all I know, it could have been part of some sort of collector's edition, so, and that is how it come. Who knows? Tells you what the game is on the side, what more do you want from that? So that was five pound, I couldn't, I can't turn down steel books that nice. Especially for five pound. As for the area, it was lovely. I see that nice Tudor has. I don't know what that was. I don't know if it was like some sort of museum or something. Not too sure, but yeah, I quite enjoyed it there. Did you enjoy it? Did I enjoy what? Sorry. Was it called Brom Bromsgate? Bromsgrove. Bromsgrove. <laughs> Bromsgrove. Yeah, I done some shopping there. It was all right. Yeah, it was all right. Yeah, it's done loads of shopping there. A lot. I left yeah. her for a bit. She just come back with two bags full of stuff. <laughs> Spent all her money. <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> Hope you've enjoyed this week's one, and as always, we will catch you in the next one. Bye for now.